Throughout her years on the volleyball scene, Evelyn Hollick accomplished many firsts in her life. She was the first female national level official in Ontario and the head coach for Ontario's women's provincial team at the inaugural Canada Games in Quebec City, where the team won gold, a result that Team Ontario women didn't duplicate until 2005. Evelyn coached the women's team at York University during the 1974-75 season and continued coaching with the OVA, leading the women's provincial team in her second set of Canada Games in 1971 in Saskatoon. Prior to her successful coaching career, Evelyn was an avid volleyball player. Evelyn played for the Team Ontario All-Stars in the International Volleyball Tour of Canada held at Maple Leaf Gardens in Toronto in October 1965, and she captained the Toronto Blues teams that won numerous national championship medals throughout the 1960s and the early 70s. A true leader, in 1967, Evelyn found time to be on the organizing committee for Canadian National Volleyball Championships and Pan Am Trials in Toronto while she continued to play competitive volleyball. She competed in her own event and was one of 19 players invited out for the Pan American Training Camp in Winnipeg. Evelyn also took up leadership and administrative duties in 1967 with the Canadian Volleyball Association when she became treasurer. She held this position for three years and during this time focused her interest toward the future development of the sport. As Evelyn continued to play and when her team couldn't find a coach, she stepped in and became a player coach for the AAE club from 1967 to 1973. Evelyn coached this team to a silver medal at the Canadian Volleyball National Championships in Winnipeg in 1970. In the early 70s, Evelyn continued coaching and worked with the Scarborough Volleyball Program. Her accomplishments and commitment to volleyball distinguished Evelyn as the first role model for female players, coaches and officials in the province of Ontario. Evelyn is highly deserving of being admitted into the OVA Hall of Fame in the coach category for her leadership with Team Ontario Women's Programs and their historic gold medal win at the inaugural Canada Games in 1967 in Quebec City.